to the grads of all elementary school, high school, post-secondary. I want to congratulate you on behalf of the Laxilio clan. It's very important today that we continue our education. The little ones, we watch them all the way to post-secondary, university grads. Open your hearts, open your minds. You can go a long ways. I think about my uh, second oldest daughter, who is a teacher. After a couple of years of teaching, she traveled the world during her time off, different parts of the world, Australia, Asia. And our people here, young ones, are watching you, all the post grads. We have one doctor. What we don't have is dentists. We have a lot of smart people in our community. Your parents, thank your parents, your aunts and uncles, stood by you during your education here, high school and post-sec. Open your minds, travel, continue. So congratulations to all the grads from elementary, high school and post-secondary. Keep on moving forward. Our young ones are watching you. They don't do as we say, they do as we do. I would say. He's at Chakra at Skyzet. My chief name is Chief Madik. I come from the house of Anasaski, where it lies blocking the trail. I come here to uh, congratulate all the graduates from uh, going to school. And I appreciate the fact that the more education you get, the more stronger you will be. I want to thank each and every one of the graduates for f f taking their time on the, in their life to finish up their education. This is only one portion of your graduate uh, of your life of education. It's uh, your uh, your learning is every day from now on. You'll be learning something new, something old, and you will be able to move forward in your life, to better your life, and to uh, come back to your community and and work in our communities to better our uh, our Wet'suwet'en system, fee system and you'll be a, a much stronger person with all the education that you get. And remember one thing, that your learning starts now for life. You got your education from the school, now your life is a, is a learning experience every day. So I want to thank you, each and every one of you, for your gradu being graduating and for us to, uh, to stand behind you as our chiefs. We are, uh, we are here for you. If there's anything that you may need, or if something that comes up that you need uh, more money for education, don't be afraid to ask. That's what our chief system is for, and to educate the people. So I want to thank each and every one of you for doing your, your hard work learning up to now. So you have a lifetime of enjoyment and enjoy each and every day 
and be there for your siblings and your family. I would say Masai. Hadi Jin Honzu Sai Sazi Tsakazi Wilat, my traditional name is Wilat. Tayu Abi Kati Sit, I come from the Tayu clan. I am honored to take this opportunity to congratulate the the Tayu students. To the kindergarten students going into grade one to the grade 7 students going into high school, to the grade 12 students going into post-secondary. I wish you luck in your future endeavors, whether you go into trades, workforce, or post-secondary. It's a journey that just begun. Masai, congratulations to all the Taiyu students. I just want the students to keep going as to what they're doing, whether it's kindergarten right into post-secondary. I wish them well and just keep going, all the Taiyu students. Okay, my name is Warner William. I'm Gilsahyu, Native Beast Chief of the Dark House. Congratulations, all the graduates from the high school. I'll give you one little pointer. Like, if I didn't finish school, I didn't even finish grade six, but my dad told me when I was in school, he says, you gotta listen to your teacher. If you don't listen to him, the teacher, he'll know you don't care. And then some students that's trying hard, he'll drop by and help them. And even after you finish school, it's the same thing. Any workplace, you gotta listen to your boss or foreman because if you don't that'll get around they'll all know your work habit that you don't want to listen you want to do your own thing it's going to be hard to get a job but after you graduate you're not done yet carry on with your school I know even when I dropped out of school my dad told me I'm going to be sorry down the road and I got by because back then you didn't need grade 12, job was looking for you. Now it's different. Now you gotta have grade 12. So, but anyway, anybody that graduated, congratulations. I hope you carry on with your school, pick up some kind of trade. And you remember, you gotta listen. Any workplace, you gotta listen. My name is Smogos Kem. I'm the head chief of the Sun House of the Laksamasu clan. I'd like to congratulate you all for graduating from the different programs that you're in. I'm always uh, pleasantly encouraged to know that a lot of our members are moving forward in life and taking on new challenges. Uh, going, to ed going to an education system and going through an education system is usually really hard. And uh, we can't help but be proud about the steps that we take as Indigenous people, especially when you look back at what we've been through. Uh, indigenous people all across North America have been through a lot since contact. And for us to rise up like this and take on, a, take on an education system and achieve something at that level is remarkable. So I'm so proud of all the people who are graduating today, especially my clan members. So I just wanna give a big, huge thank you to everybody for um, being a part of the celebration with these beautiful people and also giving them an opportunity to have a stage to to share their accomplishments because we don't do that enough. But I want to really put the word out there for everybody who's still in the, ed in the education system as well to continue what you're doing, to keep fighting hard because uh, the ancestors who fought hard didn't fight hard for nothing. So thank you all. Masai. Now what's up? My name is Michelle Joseph Shaw. My clan is Luxilliu. I belong to the House of Many Eyes and my house chief is Hegwilnech. So I graduated from Smithers Secondary School in 2018. After that, I decided to go to attend the USEP program in Witset. I graduated from that program in 2019 and I decided to apply to Thompson Rivers University. I have now completed my second year at Thompson Rivers University and received an executive assistant diploma. I'm a continuing student, so I'm working towards completing 
a Bachelor's of Business Administration with a major in Human Resource Management. So it, it's definitely been really hard and challenging. Um, it takes a lot of dedication, discipline, and um, consistency. But there's a lot of support out there, especially as Indigenous students. There's so many opportunities, and I just encourage everyone to take their education serious. So congratulations to all the grads of 2021, and I wish you nothing but the best for the future. My name is Sherry McKinnon, and I recently graduated from the Bachelor of Social Work program at the University of Northern British Columbia. It took me four years to get there. Um, I first started out at Langara in 2017 um, and it was very challenging at the time because I was taking seven classes plus a practicum which meant eight classes total and if I had any advice for anyone going into the bachelor program for social work is to um, Probably take the psychology and English course first, and then it will be a lot easier moving forward. So living in Vancouver, I wasn't prepared to um, live in such an expensive city. Um, for those that have gone to the city, they know exactly what I'm talking about. The cost of living is so high there. But with the support of my family, my siblings, and my wonderful husband and my children, I was able to make it, as well as Quest. I couldn't have did it without Quest. Um, so shortly after, I moved to Prince George and started the program there at the UNBC campus. And in the first year, I had to deal with uh, the strike that happened there, which was also another challenge that I overcame. And then COVID hit. And that meant all my studies were online, so I had to learn how to maneuver my way through online studies. Um, if anybody is going through any of these educational journeys, you know, I applaud you. It's such a rewarding experience because at least you have accomplished one thing and that was actually moving away to go to school or doing it online. So congratulations to other grads, whether you're graduating from daycare, uh, from elementary school, high school, and post-secondary, way to go. And thank you for the opportunity. Denise Sakoze Skaze. Uh, Sai Sozi Aaron Burgess. Uh, I sit with Laxilu clan in the Feast Hall. Um, I'm the executive director with Kaiwaget Education Society. I've been in this role for one year now and uh, have been involved with the Education Society teaching uh, multiple levels and uh, uh, different programs for, for a lot of years now. And I just want to take this moment to congratulate all of the grade sevens, uh, Muheim, Walnut Park, Whitsett Elementary, uh, all of the grade 12s graduating, um, Smithers Secondary, um, I count, uh, all of the adult ed students through USEP and Discovery, as well as uh, post-secondary students that are out at the institutes throughout uh, the province and the country. Uh, we have a lot to be proud of in, in Whitsett here with, with the amount of uh, people getting educated, and it's really, really a great thing to see. Uh, when, I, when I look out and, and think about people that are Wet'suwet'en in, uh, in the workforce and, and you see Wet'suwet'en doctors, uh, Wet'suwet'en lawyers, Wet'suwet'en social workers, Wet'suwet'en teachers, Wet'suwet'en people in the trades, uh, heavy machine operators, there, there's a lot of employment um, that comes from a lot of, a lot of uh, education and it's such a wonderful thing to see uh, the, the education levels of, of the Wet'suwet'en as well as the, the um, opportunities that's presented to them after education. Our Quest mission statement is uh, Wet'suwet'en values empower lifelong learners to realize their potential 
Uh, and, and I think that's really key in all of our programs and in all of our education capacity, uh, realizing our potential. Um, so I just want to, want to uh, point to you, all of you graduates uh, this year, you know, reach for the sky, achieve your dreams because you really can achieve these and we see that with all of the Witsilodin people and, and Witsit community members that are, that are doing such wonderful things in, in their post-secondary and uh, careers afterwards. So congratulations again uh, from Kiowa Education Society. You really deserve to be recognized for all of your uh, academic and educational achievements uh, on behalf of myself. Um, and the whole organization uh, and the community, we're, we're all so proud of all of you. Snekalia. Hey, Denise Takoze Skyze, Saisozi Amanda Lewis, Nikip De Pitse, Antlo Bayez. I come to you today as the Kiowa Get Education Society board chair, an excited community member and a teacher. I have the privilege today on behalf of the Kiowa Get Education Society to commend the graduates from high school about to begin a journey that will lead them towards a higher learning in their chosen field. We congratulate the USEP and Discovery students who have com successfully completed their programs. We uplift college and university students who have acquired the credits for their certificate, diploma, or degree. We as Quest also support the grade seven students making their transition to high school. You finished your work. Commencement isn't about just celebrating the fact that you finally earned your diploma, certificate, or degree. It's about looking forward to all the places life will take you after grad. Witsudan people are progressive and resilient people. To this is a, a teaching that has always encouraged me. To me, Nohtsadetni, our ancestors, guide and challenge us with their teachings and wisdom on how to be progressive in the world we live in today. Their classrooms were on the Yinta, in structures like the smokehouse and batlats. Nohtsadetni, Haba Aden, the ways of our ancestors, are an encouragement to keep your Witsuit in shape while learning in the different classrooms we have today, to be successful in the progressive world we live in now. Be present in your learning, grounding yourself in no Sedetni Haba Aden. We celebrate all our Witsuit graduates and look forward with you to all the places life will take you.